What is going on guys, Tiswafa here, and welcome back to some more Stardew Valley. Now, last time we left off, somehow my dog didn't wake up during that intro right there, but uh, last time we left off, we actually had like a- oh wait, no, there he is. <laughs> last time we left off, we had like a flower flower dance festival or something like that, uh, and we just kind of attended it, talked to everyone, and then we didn't dance. Like, we saw other people dance, we didn't dance though, that kind of sucked. Oh man, we have a lot of finished crops here, I think we like the- actually harvested these last episode, at the end of last episode. Oh wait, are these ready too? Oh, I guess not. But I think we harvested all those at the end of last episode, but of course, uh, like it saves every time you sleep, so it didn't save all that stuff. Either way, uh, apparently I would have been able to dance during that little festival thing if I actually talked to someone the day before the festival and actually uh, asked them to dance or had them, uh, wait, either I asked them to dance or they asked me to dance or something like that. Uh, which kind of sucks because like th literally during the festival I was talking to like multiple people they were like oh man I wish I could dance with someone I wish I had the courage to ask someone to dance I, I'm like I would have danced if I was able to but uh, I, I guess I couldn't there so that kind of sucked but I guess maybe next year we'll be able to uh, to do that and speaking of new seasons new years whatever else you can see that it's uh, Friday the 26th of spring right now so only a few days until the end of spring and I do believe today's Pierre's birthday and if I remember correctly he does like tulips so I do want to give him a tulip I don't think it matters what color uh oh man I grabbed multiple right there and uh I kind of want to make sure oh wait oh is this order it uh I think this automatically orders it by who has the most hearts here so I was wondering why Shane was at the very top there randomly uh but that's because we gave him a birthday present and uh I think something else I forget uh, but yeah, he really likes us right now. And then Rob in second place. Uh, man, we've actually done a decent amount of a uh, decent good job, you know, gifting people things here. I'm like, I've been going out of my way lately. Oh, yeah, George. Somehow we have a heart with. Jo oh, yeah, because I did that mission for him, didn't I? <laughs> yeah, but I might as well go give George a rose or something like that. I don't know. And of course, we need to just generally just talk to everyone as well. That's something we could do as well. Uh, is there any, who's, who's at the who's at the very. OK, I guess the wizard. I guess I can give him a gift, but like, what would I even get him? And then Sebastian, two gifts there, but they are failed. So obviously, like, he didn't like it. He's at the very bottom there. Evelyn, uh, I'm surprised we don't have anything there for Evelyn. But either way, uh, what was I doing there? I was trying to look for whatever that guy's name is. Uh, Pierre, I believe. Yep, there he is right there. So, yes. Okay, so he does like, like tulips. I just wanted to make sure there, make sure I didn't mess up. Uh, something I did also read multiple comments from last episode is that, ah, uh, man, how can I test this out right now? I guess a piece of wood, don't I need that? I think so, and like stone or something like that. But apparently if I like hover over an item while like checking my inventory, uh, which would be this one, if I like hover over an item, you can see for the wood, I think we need that for the construction uh, and the stone. I think we need that for the construction like bundle or whatever it's called. And then if I hover over this, yeah, look at the uh, community center thing. It's gonna like start, start like, pulsating I guess you could describe it as which is interesting you guys commented saying if I if, if I have an item that's in my inventory I hover over it and the community center needs it it's going to pulsate like that to kind of symbolize oh you might want to go to the community center with that item Hata which is really really cool I, I don't know how anyone would have figured that out that seems so like random but we do have a lot of stone there which is good so we could actually go sell that uh and then while we're in the area I, I guess we'll just uh go do the community center or uh, wait, what was I saying I don't want to sell the com uh, I did it backwards. I want to go s not sell the tulip either. I didn't want to sell anything. I, mean, I want to go give the tulip to the guy that sells us things and that we sell stuff to him. And then also go to the community center and just kind of donate that. And we do have a note over here with an exclamation point. So let's go see what's going on over here. I have a craving for a Joja Cola. Well, too bad I don't have any. <laughs> it's from Clint. Uh, too bad I don't have a Joja Cola that we got out of the trash at one time. 75G on delivery and makes Clint happy. I guess we'll accept it. So, uh, oh, does this say, oh wait, 9 a, okay, 9 a.m. to 9 p.m. right there. I guess I'll check the trash, but I don't know what the luck is today. Oh, nothing there, okay. And then there's Shane right there. Yep, okay, nothing there either. <laughs> I'm just going to check all the trash cans. I don't, I, I don't even know what my luck is today. Oh yeah, you guys said, uh, oh, we have a snail over here. Or is that a, uh, yeah, it's a snail, nice. You guys said to go down here, like, every day. You guys remember, yeah, also last episode, this was something we did too. <laughs> Finally repaired this bridge, and uh, now we can go over here and get, like, corals and stuff like that. But you guys said to come over here, like, every day to get, like, corals. That way we could uh, sell those and get decent money out of them. And specifically come back here whenever it's raining and something special is going to happen or something interesting or something like that. But I'm not seeing any, like, corals or anything like that. Either that, or, either that or there are corals, and I just don't see them. And they're kind of blending in, and I'm not seeing them right now. Which kind of sucks. Hmm. 
I guess while I'm in the area, I might as well fish a little bit. Uh, it's 9.30 a.m. right now. Eh, we got plenty of time. I guess I'll go fishing real quick. Definitely do need the practice, though, because we, we were fishing last episode successfully, but at the same time, we came over here and failed horribly, too. <laughs> so I, I kind of want to redeem myself over here, even though, like, literally... Oh, 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 I had an exclamation point above my head, but I guess, it, ah, I guess it wasn't ready just yet right there. I got it too prematurely, and I missed it before it bit. Oh, oh. here we go. There's a hit. Nice. All right, let's keep it behind the fish. And apparently, oh gosh. Apparently, if you keep it behind the fish, you'll get a perfect. And the perfect means you uh, have a more likelihood of getting like a gold star, silver star, or whatever else. So that's really cool. Decent job right there. A sardine. One inch sardine. That is nothing. How in the world did I put up a fight with a sardine that's an inch? Can they really be that small? That seems a little bit small. That is like nothing. Like, I'm genuinely surprised right there. I need to look that up. Like, I, aren't those the, no, wait, I'm thinking of anchovies, aren't I? The ones that come with the cans? I don't know. Or are those the ones that are on the pizza? Or are those the same ones? I forget. Oh, jeez. Man, I did it prematurely again. <laughs> oh, man. All right. Well, let's just wait until we get, I'm over here, like, thinking about, like, anchovies on pizzas and, like, canned fish and stuff like that. <laughs> <laughs> Get really distracted here. Either way, let's just let's just fish until we have I don't know like two more or something like that, and then we can sell them to uh, Willie, get some good money, and uh, give uh, Pierre a tulip, and that's going to be great because it's oh my gosh I did it again too early I keep hearing the sound, but it ah uh, I need I need to wait until it actually like shows that there's a bite or whatever for okay. Wait, is it actually me or because I, I had the exclamation point above my head I had the sound right there. Doesn't seem like there's any like visual indicator other than the exclamation point above your head. I guess I'm just really not. Oh, oh. here we go. Okay, there we go. We got to hit that. Oh my gosh, I didn't keep it behind the fish right there perfectly. Oh, I'm keeping it behind it right now though. Oh, this one's decently easy. Too bad I messed up there. It's another sardine, but it's a nine-inch one. Okay, so that one, that one sounds a lot more realistic. <laughs> An inch sardine. And it was a gold. Ooh, and we didn't even get perfect there. I don't think, right? So I guess it just, like, gives you a better likelihood of getting a perfect, but at the same time, you don't need to get a perfect in order to get a gold star down there, which is interesting. Either way, oh, can I even go into here? Can I talk to this? Only Elliot's friends. Okay, now, I, there are certain people, well, but <laughs> there's, like, trash over there, who I want to become, like, decent, fr oh, and there's Elliot right there. I want to become decent friends with them just, just so I can go inside their houses, see what it's look like, and go inside their rooms and stuff like that, right? The fresh air in this valley is good for my body and mind. Well, hey, do you like trash? <laughs> I'm not going to give him a trash. Randomly give him a snail or something like that. Well, I've got two tulips, so this is for me. Marvel. Hey, he liked that. That's good. So we gave him a tulip. Let's go give the other one to Pierre. And then uh, let's see. I guess I'll sell him. Yeah, I'll sell the sardine. Oh, wait, I didn't see how much money I'd get out of that. So we get 40 for that one. I don't know, probably like 80 for the gold star one. Then a snail, 65. I guess I'll sell that. Then a sunfish. I think we need to keep that for the community center. Oh, 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 oh. There's a way for us to check, right? Yep, looking at the community center little icon over there starting to pulsate right there. Interesting. Community center doesn't need any trash, though. Sap. No, 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 no sap. Okay. Well, either way. Oh, yeah. Uh, I wanted to check about my... Oh, whoa! Look at the seagulls. I wanted to check about my pickaxe as well. Watch. By the time we actually go back to Pierre, it's going to be like... This is nighttime. It's going to be like 9, 10 p.m. or something like that. He's going to be closed, and I can't give him a second thing. Oh, I guess I could if I go to the, uh, go to the, I think he hangs out in the pub at night, or, uh, what is it called? The saloon at night. Yeah, I think so. So if, if I did miss him in his, uh, in his work area, in his, in his shop, I could always give him a gift at the, uh, saloon. Either way, uh, I'm still working on your copper pickaxe. It won't be ready today. Okay, I guess we have to come back tomorrow then. I don't know how many days it takes to, uh, to, to upgrade the pickaxe there, but... Whatever. Look at all the butterflies. There's so many of them right now. It's crazy. Either way. Uh, oh, yeah. Speaking of fish and whatnot. I did get a comment saying if I wanted to find like the, what was it? The largemouth bass or something like that. We could actually catch that one in the lake up here at the top of the river or uh, at the bottom of the mountain and the top of the river right there, which is interesting because I don't think that's like the one place I haven't fished yet. So if I want to go over there, maybe uh, maybe like right now or something like that, like right after we go over to Pierre's or something. Oh, yeah. And then oh seeds for sale. Ooh. Well, I'm like, it's the end of the month, so these seeds are kind of on clearance now, aren't they? I guess so, huh? Uh, are they any cheaper than uh, normal? I don't know. 
Oh yeah, I don't know. Did I bring this up last time? I forget. But you guys said, hey, that gold, uh, what was it? it was, was that a daffodil or something else? Oh yeah, it was a gold parsnip, I think. That gold parsnips that I bought from him, and yeah, the gold potato right here, silver potato. Those were ones that I sold to him, and he's selling back to me, and of course I have to buy it back for more money, so he makes money, so yeah. Uh, at least we have a gold star parsnip. At least you're able to get your stuff back if you sell them, and you're, you just pay a little bit extra. Oh, hi there, is your farm doing well? Yeah, it is. Oh yeah, and I also got some comments that we got saying to, uh, to talk to people multiple times until they like start repeating things, because you might miss out on stuff too. Maybe a few of my seeds will spruce things up. And yeah, look at that, he, he, I can't talk to him anymore. So yeah, he was able to be talked to twice right there, which is interesting. But let's give him a tulip. A birthday gift? That's very kind of you. I love it. Hey, that's good. Well, hopefully we get a good relationship with him, just like we do with Abigail over here, right? Because we gave her a uh, an amethyst, I think, two episodes ago or something like that. Oh, wow, well, I just realized it's Friday. Yeah, it's going to be a great day to go to the saloon at night, right? Sometimes I totally lose track of time. I agree. I, I lose track of time as well, especially <laughs> while I'm recording the second series here, you guys. Every episode being like 40, 50 hour long minute videos. <laughs> it's a beautiful day, isn't it? Yeah, it is, Harvey. It certainly is. Oh, yeah, he's got a fancy mustache right there. Wish I had less work to do. What does he do? Is he, uh, do work here or something like that? I don't know. I guess I, I don't know, actually. I now want to think about it. I need to pay attention to that kind of stuff. Either way, let's go to the community center. We got rocks and... Well, I'm not going to donate any of the logs. I doubt I have any, uh, enough logs. Oh, wait, there's the uh, the Mary guy. Let's go talk to him. I hope things are going well on French Toast Farm. I'd hate to see it all dried up. Me too. Oh, gosh, that reminds me. I need to go water my farm today. <laughs> Whoops. Well, we still have until uh, the end... Of, literally the end of the day, right? Haley is... <laughs> okay. I, I, I... Does she actually hate me? Or is she just like that, like, savage? I don't, oh, and Pierre's two hearts now. Awesome. Oh, I, sh I saw Shane earlier. I should have talked to him. And then Demetrius, I think he should be in this area. I guess we'll talk to him as well. Uh, Abigail, I don't think we gave her a present, but we don't have anything to give either, so that kind of sucks. But uh, let's go to the community center before I can forget. <laughs> and then uh, I guess we'll go over here and donate, I think, either one or two things, depending on uh, on which one would it be, though. I think the, con I think the construction was this one. Ah, uh, yes, construction bundle. Okay, perfect. So we have 99 stone. Boom. 99 stone there. So we need to get 99 wood and then another 99 wood and then hardwood. We need 10 of that. And I think we have like three or four at home. And I think we got that from a barrel back at the uh, mine. So that's definitely something to think about. Either way, spring crops bundle, cauliflower, potato. Well, at least we gave it the cauliflower. We need the green beans and the parsnips. I Do we have green beans? Oh, we could do this. Why did I not... Ah, uh, hold on. Let's go back to the farm. I think we could buy a parsnip from uh, Pierre right now. Don't think we could buy any green beans, and I don't know if any of our green beans are ready to be harvested. I don't know. If, I think we sold all of ours. I need to go check the storage. Thankfully, we like kind of separated the storage and stuff like that, just to kind of make sure <laughs> that we didn't sell anything we didn't need to, right? But at the same time, I might have already sold it, so I kind of like. Uh, scroll all the way to the bottom, I guess. Potato, leek, dandelion. Yeah, these are just ones that I sold him, which is okay. At least we got a little bit of money. We can always buy it later if we need to, right? But, uh... Yeah, he's not hes not selling any parsnips. He's not selling any leeks. Ah, man. I don't know. I don't think we're growing any right now. And there's only a few days left in the, in the month. And speaking of such, let's check the calendar real quick. Uh, oh, tomorrow's Emily's birthday. Ooh, hold on. We might as well use today. Who is Emily? And where does where she hang out? Do we know anything? Oh, wait, there she is. She's basically at the bottom. Do we know what she at least... Okay, she doesn't like salmon berries. So let's not give her a salmon berry. Let's give her... Let's go home. Let's go get like a... I don't know. Should I buy a dandelion? I'm like, I want to find a dandelion. That'd save me some time and money. But either a dandelion. I don't know if I have any extra tulips or anything like that. But usually a lot of those random things seem to spawn over here. So let's check up here. Oh yeah, and I did get comments from you guys saying, uh, speaking of this, like, bust right here, uh, you guys were saying, you, you know, last episode, I found that, uh, that statue behind our house, and then that, like, memorial of our grandfather or something like that, as well, uh, but apparently the statue over here behind our house is, like, a teleporter or something like that, as well as the one that's, like, red that's over by Demetrius's house, it's, like, like, where is it? Yeah, like, right here-ish, under that cliff. And then there's the blue one that's like right here. Apparently the fourth one is, I guess it's all the way over here in the desert. You ride the, the bus all the way over there. It's over there in the desert. You kind of use that to teleport. So that's kind of interesting there. So 
I, obviously, I can't use it right now because I, I guess I haven't found the fourth one. Otherwise, uh, I'd be able to teleport all over the place, which would actually be pretty handy. Either way, let's get the watering can scythe. I don't think we need that. We need to water our crops before I forget. But uh, hopefully by tomorrow or whatever, we'll actually have some parsnips and green beans. We'll actually be able to. Uh, oh yeah, I need to do. I need to do the new method of uh, doing this: standing in one spot and there you go, being able to water three different spots at once, which is really good. Wait, I don't, oh man, see, with the green beans, it's hard to tell what you've watered and what you haven't. And then over here, we have strawberries as well. There's like one pixel of red right there, so it looks like the strawberries are growing ever so slightly. They're so teeny tiny and stuff. There you go, fill up the watering can. All right, nice. Well, either way, uh, oh yeah, I need to go. I'm, I'm going to go. I'm going to water the dog. I'm going to pet him. Hopefully, we actually get... Wait, is, is Zongus on this social thing? Actually, I don't know if he actually is. I never paid attention. I guess not. That'd be kind of weird, though. Like, can I give Zongus a gift like rocks? I don't know if I can. Yeah, I don't think so. Yeah, it's not letting me. Don't give him a bomb. Oh, I forgot to give it the... Ah, well, there you go. I right-clicked him right there. But I, for I forgot to put the uh, the sunfish in the community center. I need to go do that. But let's go up here. Let's see if we could... Uh... Oh, yeah, you can't find parsnips out here. You can only find... You can only grow parsnips and, like, green beans, like, at your house, which sucks. But either way, I guess we'll go up here anyways. Maybe we'll talk to Demetrius, give him, uh, well, I don't have a potato for him, but I guess just talk to him or something like that if I can, right? Okay, I think. Is there anyone? No. I don't see him over here. Okay, whatever. <laughs> Alright, I guess we'll head south and, uh, go to the community center, go give it the sunfish or whatever that is down there. Oh yeah, and then I wanted to go find Emily. It is Friday, so I don't know if she hangs out in the, uh, saloon. But I do want to go give her a plant. I guess I'll give her that leek right there, see if she likes that leek. <laughs> I don't know if she will, but I guess we'll check. Uh... But let's go up here. Let's give this. What was I doing? No, not the. Oh, man. Yeah, the fish it needs to go over here in the aquarium. Yeah, let's go over here. Oh, yeah, it, we have another one over here. I forgot about that. Yeah, we got the boiler room or whatever. I need to go to see what's all over there because I am not. Yes, yeah, sunfish. Boom. OK, perfect. Catfish. Oh, yeah. Was it? I should have checked if the uh, bream walleye. What would it be? Ocean? Oh, yeah. Sardine. I guess I can go buy it. Tuna. I guess I'll go buy the regular sardine back from Willy. Get a little bit of money out of that. But what else did we uh, would need over here for the boiler room specifically? Oh, yeah, just three of them. Blacksmith. Oh, yeah, copper bar, iron bar. Yeah, so we're able to buy stuff from the blacksmith. It's just that he's busy with our uh, pickaxe. It's like he's upgrading our pickaxe right now. So I could buy iron uh, ore from him, which we get five of to smelt into one iron ingot or bar, whatever you want to call it. And we could use one over there or we could use one to actually make the sprinkler. So... Oh, and it's 8.30 p.m. right now. Um, Yeah, Will, yeah, he's closed right now, which sucks. So I can't buy, I can't get the fish back, unfortunately. I'm like, I could always just go fishing again. It's not like, oh, I don't know. Now that I think about it, I don't know if, do fish, like certain fish hang out in certain seasons too? I don't know. Let me know in the comments down below if you guys know, like, do certain fish only hang out during the spring and summer? That'd be kind of weird. Like, oh, geez. Hey, there's Demetrius. I want to talk to him. Robin has a hot temper. <laughs> it's good to stay on her good side. And then right next to Robin, he says that. Oh, wait, what the, oh, I missed what he said right there. What do you have to say about that, Robin? You've met my son, Sebastian, right? He lives downstairs. Wait, Sebastian. Oh, yeah, yeah, I remember. Yeah, the guy that's like locked in the bottom there. Or <laughs> locks himself in the bottom of the, uh, in the basement. He's a, he's a little shy, but I'm sure he'll warm up to you if you're nice to him. Uh, I guess if I just talk to him, maybe we can get some conversation going and learn a little bit more about him. I think the, oh, wait, is that him? Wait, who's that? Who's this? Oh, wait, that, that's Abigail. Oh, wait, no, is that him? That's him right there. Yes, there's Sebastian. Uh, I don't really know you. Well, get to know me, hater. Well, I guess you can't. I guess you don't want to. Okay, whatever. Well, there's people just, like, leaving all over the place. I need to find this Emily. Oh, wait, there she is right there. Yeah, she's like a, a bartender or something like that. I guess I'll talk to her. Or, uh, should I give her a leak? I guess I'll give her a leak. See what she thinks about it. Oh, hey, hey, I guess she likes it. Okay, so... I guess we'll get another leak tomorrow, give it to her on her birthday, and get some good, uh, get some good progress going with her friendship, right? Oi, Gus, give me another pint of your strongest. Oh, jeez, Pam. <laughs> another one right there. Uh, I guess, I guess the social thing is kind of different whenever you're in the bar here. Business has been really good tonight, I'm pleased. I wonder why we got and Pam over here every night, your best customer. A quick stroll outdoors always invigorates me. Okay, well, I just kind of want to go over here because there's so many people grouped together. I do want to talk with everyone, get a little bit of social going on, right? It's, uh, it's simpler to be friends with the trees. They don't have much to say. And, yeah, well, you don't have anything else to say other than, uh, that you're a tree hugger, right? Marty doesn't seem to notice that you're there. <laughs> oh, my gosh. 
first I get like ignored by Haley or whatever her name is, and then Marnie doesn't even notice me. Good evening, it's nice to see you socializing with the townsfolk. Well, I'm like, it's something I need to do anyways, right? It's good to stop by once in a while and see what the latest news is. That's right. Now as Nars, Marnie actually knows me. I'm like right in front of you and you still don't notice me. What? Does she have like blinders on? Like a horse or something like that? <laughs> she doesn't see like, like to the right of her just a little bit. I'm standing like right there. <laughs> okay, whatever. Who's this guy? Oh, this is PS. Yeah, see, look at that. I knew he hung out in the uh, saloon here. I've been working all week. I deserve a little relaxation on Friday night. Oh, hey, it's your birthday, too, so you deserve a uh, double relaxation. Yeah, now that you think about it, he was working on his birthday. He should have at least had the day off, but then again, he had Wednesday off, right? So taking Wednesday off and then Friday off that, you can't really pay the bills if he doesn't work all the time, right? I've been working. Oh, yeah, he just said the same thing right there. Okay, Willie. What do you have to say? Handling salty fish all day makes me real thirsty. Well, hopefully you haven't been eating those fish. And yeah, okay, there you go. Maybe you're just making up excuses so you can drink. <laughs> the weather doesn't seem to matter to me. I typically stay near my shop year round. Yeah, well, you're... Why? Well, I guess some blacksmith can be like outside uh, blacksmith like we had back in Skyrim, right? But then Shane here. Don't you have work to do? Golly, I thought Shane's like my best friend. Like at the moment, he's still being an absolute savage to me. Ah, man. All right, is there anyone over here? No one playing pool. Can you actually play that? Like, if someone's over here, are you actually able to play pool? That'd be really cool. Oh, and someone wanted the Joja call. Hold on, is this how you get it from the vending machine? Uh, 75 gold. Hold on. Is that? I think that's how much you actually get. Yeah, 75 gold. To give it to Clint, but he, he's like, he's right there. I guess we'll give it to him before I forget. We won't actually make any money, but at least we'll get some like respect points or uh, social friendship points with him, I suppose. But let's give it to Clint. So let's see. Let's go to Joji Cole. Let's give him the gift. And boom. Hello, Waffle. So you saw uh, the ad I posted. It looks perfect. Well, hey, I got it out of the vending machine like right there. I don't know why you couldn't go get it yourself. <laughs> but I'm not going to complain, okay? Here's your payment as promised. All right. Well, that paid for the drink like straight up. So <laughs> I guess I can't complain there. You have anything else to say? Depressing, huh? What in the... That's kind of depressing in and of itself. <laughs> All right, I guess I talked to everyone over here. Oh, yeah, can I actually buy anything from this guy? Yeah, beer, salad, bread. Oh, yeah, you got, I remember you guys commented saying the stuff that he sells is actually, like, really good for, like, energy and all that kind of Like, look at all that. Salad gives you 113 energy. And what do we have, like, 200 and something? 270, so that's, like, almost half. A little bit under half right there. Golly. Pizza? 150? Well, that's 600. Oh, that's a lot of money right there. And somehow, well, I was about to say, somehow coffee only gives you three energy, but it gives you a plus one speed. Now, how long does that last? For like a day or something, I guess. Hash browns recipe, so I can actually make these at home pancakes. Um, I assume we need to actually, uh, yeah, milk and eggs. We actually need uh, creatures for that. Like actual, oh, spicy eel. Careful, it's really spicy. Uh, 115 health. You get luck and speed. Ooh. But it's, you get three of them for 350. Oh, wait, no, no, no. You get one for 350, but he has three in stock. I keep misinterpreting that. Either way, I don't know if I actually want to buy anything there. Uh, I suppose we'll go to bed now. Yeah, 11.50. Yeah, I got a comment from someone saying, hey, go to bed before midnight and you'll wake up with like more energy or something like that. Yeah, it's getting late, yeah. I think it's too late. Like, it's probably going to be like 12, 10, 12, 20 or something like that by the time we actually get home. So it's a little bit too late for that, unfortunately. But hey, we got a lot of good progress done uh, socializing with people. Yeah, 12, 10. Gave uh, Pierre his, his birthday present. Now we know that, uh, what was her name? Emily, her birthday's today. Is there anything I want to sell real quick? Yeah, I don't think so. I think we're good to go. Someone did say uh, in the comments that like literal trash like has a purpose like later on. So I guess I'll keep some of it. And, you know, I'm, I, I have an inventory space. So I might as well keep it, right? <laughs> or the storage space. So I, I'll just put that up right there. Uh, oh, yeah. Do I have green? Yeah, I do have green beans. Oh, okay, I do have green beans. I do have parsnips here. Per Okay. Well, I don't want to grab all of them. But I'll put those up. Boom. And then uh, we know that. Uh, what was her name? Emily. I keep forgetting. I literally just said it. <laughs> I think we know uh, that she likes leaks, right? So let's, let's keep that in our inventory for her birthday. Let's check the... Uh, oh, is this time? I think the time pauses whenever your game is paused, which is good, because I, I want to look at stuff over here. So let's see. What was I doing? I was I was looking at... Yeah, what was Haley like? Does she actually like anything? Do I know if she... Yeah, she doesn't like Salmonberry. Well, she might as well put me over, like a picture of me right there. Because <laughs> she doesn't like me, obviously. I wonder if that's something you, you could actually figure out, like... Oh, this person doesn't like this person. You know, kind of like bug snacks, where uh, some of the people don't like other some people, and some people like some people. I don't know. I guess everyone's just friendly with each other, except for Haley with me. <laughs> uh, 
<laughs> Either way, what was I doing here? Oh yeah, Emily. I was I was going to look at that. So let's see. Uh, yes. Okay. So leak in in that little backpack right there indicates I do have that in my inventory, which is good. So let's give her the leak. I think we already watered everything today, which is good. Uh, in the morning. Oh. Okay. There you go. Now we can go to sleep. In the morning, I do want to go check up on the black. Oh yeah, he doesn't open immediately, does he? Probably have to wait until like 9 a.m. or something like that. Oh, wait, what's this? Oh yeah, we got the uh yeah for doing that delivery there. Yeah, there you go. Jody's request. What was that again? A cauliflower. Do I have a? I don't know. I had that request for a while. Yeah, I don't have a qual. Man, I gave one to the community center. I don't have a an extra one to give it to her, unfortunately. So did I quit a quest, or am I just gonna? Oh yeah, I guess like I don't know. I guess I'll have. I'll keep the quest until next year and then give her the cauliflower a year late and then she'll be like, oh, wait, why are you giving me a cauliflower? <laughs> and then she'll be like, yeah, yeah, okay, yeah, let me just give me a little bit of money there. <laughs> Either way. Oh, whoa, wait. Oh, I didn't mean to. Well, I guess I did. Okay, well, at least it's going to tell us the weather. It's going to be beautiful sunny day tomorrow. Hey. Anyways, I did want to pick that up because someone said, what was it? That I, I can place this like one more. I don't think so. Like. Yeah, see, it's turning red whenever I try and do that, so I guess I can't place that back anymore. Oh, yeah, and then, uh... Oh, someone said... How to rotate this, uh, the chair. Ah, oh, man, that was, like, ah, like five videos ago or something like that, though. I, I know it's possible, though. What is it? Is it this? No. Ah, uh, you know what? Let me, let me just go look that up real quick. Okay, I looked it up. It's right-click. Oh, <laughs> put the chair on top of the table! Okay, yeah, there you go. Right click. Okay, simple enough. I guess we'll move the other uh, table. <sighs> Where do I want to move that? I kind of want to move it out of the way of that. You know, maybe I'll put it like right here. But then uh, we can pick, we can pick up the uh, that. We put that like right here. Oh, whoops. Right click. It'd be really nice if they actually did. Uh... Oh, can I move the? If I move the TV, can I actually rotate that? Oh, I can't. Yeah, okay. The TV always has to face that direction. Oh, okay. And then the fireplace, I doubt I can rotate that, but I kind of want to have some room over there and whatnot, you know, but, uh, hmm. But, I, you know, I just wanted to open up the area in general, but, you know, this is fine. I just wanted to myth bust that, because someone told me I could move the TV back one more there, and I guess I can't, which sucks. Either way, fortune teller, let's see how our luck is today. Uh, hey, spirits are very happy today, and they'll do their best to shower you with, uh, good fortune. Okay, so that's good. Either way, so we have the, uh, we have the parsnip. Whoa, uh, these, oh, yep, green beans, right, yep, I see the little green bean icons there, look like little green bananas. <laughs> oh, wait, yeah, no, don't eat the green bean, do not eat the green, I thought those, like, rice things were ready, but, yeah, and then there's cauliflower right there as well, yeah, they're, they're not going to be ready in, like, the next two or three days or whatever, but I'll still water them anyways, just because why not? Oh, whoops, I forgot, I forgot the new method of, let's see, let's stand here, and then we'll water all these, yes, like so, all right. Just like this. Wait, oh man, I watered it. There you go. All right. Yeah, I, I've also been. Oh, was there a thing? There is. A hey, there was a wild horse. I didn't even see that horse rash right there. <laughs> but uh, there, there have been multiple comments saying, "Hey, you shouldn't." I don't water the front door. <laughs> I don't even need to go in here. We have the chest right here. I forgot about that. But uh, I, I got so many comments from guys saying, "Hey, install this mod, install that mod." I don't think I'm going to be installing any mods for this uh, first series here. Because I, I just want to experience the game like, you know, as it was intended to be experienced. At least for the first playthrough. You know, I, just like with Terraria, just like with Slime Rancher. Uh, maybe I'll do like a second season of this game with mods. But you know, by how long it sounds like this game is, it seems like this is going to be pretty far into the future. But for right now, I'm just going to be playing with no mods and have fun uh, experiencing the game like this. Either way, hi, me sell hats, okay? Poke, come to old, old house, poke, bring coiners, hat mouse. What? Wait, where are hat mouse? Wait. You don't have any wait, huh? What is hat mouse? Someone sells hats? Who? Someone like writing in broken English there. I can't really tell what they're trying to say. I guess we'll sell the green beans at uh the oh whoops, hit the microphone right there. I guess we'll sell the green beans at our uh gold star and silver star right there, and then go donate the parsnip, go donate the regular green bean. I then go give the leak to Emily. I guess she works in the saloon, but I don't know if they're open this early in the morning, which is kind of weird because it's 9 a.m. It's not really early anymore. <laughs> it's almost like afternoon time here, but let's go over here to the community center. And by the way, I haven't seen too many salmon berries like grow back. I guess we cleaned out the whole entire community of all the salmon berries, haven't we? <laughs> let's go up here real quick. I think this is the one that needed the uh, spring crops. Yes. So let's give it the parsnip. Boom. And a regular green bean. 
Boom, bundle complete. Nice. All right, so what are we going to get from this? There it is, rewards. 20 speed grow. Ooh, okay, so that's going to be really, really good for the start of the new season uh, here in a couple days, you guys, which is probably, oh, whoa. Look at the little, little guy there carrying the little spring crops bundle. Oh, we got a, a quest or a bulletin or whatever. Wait, where, where's this guy going? He's going to go inside a little tree house just like the other one did? Oh, yep, he is. He's taking it inside there. <laughs> okay, so we made offerings to them or something like that, right? Oh, is that a trash can I can loot? I was about to say, like, that trash can has been there this whole time and I never looted it. But we do have, like, some sort of what looks like a mission or something like that over here, a right? quest on the blue. Oh, wait, what? Oh, wait, hold on, hold on. Reward is friendship. Chef's bundle, die bundle. Pop maple fiddlehead fern maki roll fried egg truffle. OK, well, I assume we need to buy that from someone. I just don't know who probably the chef. Oh, wait, die bundle. This is uh, this is Emily. I think. That, yeah. Woman whose birthday is today. Right. So can I buy dyes from her or something or uh, give her things to turn into dye or get recipes from her or something? like that? I don't know. Either way, sea urchin. We had that, but I guess we can go over there and check and see if it's still over there. Uh, or if another one spawned in, because we didn't see anything yesterday. Sunflower, then red cabbage, aqua, aquamarine, sea urchin, duck feather, red mushroom there. Oh, whoops, that's the same thing, right? Field research. Purple mushroom, nautilus shell, chub, and a frozen geode. Haven't seen those. R uh, oak, resin, wine, rabbit's foot, pomegranate. Haven't seen either, uh, none of those. Hay and wheat and apple. So we're going to start growing like wheat or something like that here pretty soon because it's like almost summertime. Like I'm not a farmer or anything like that, but I just kind of assume you grow that stuff in the summertime. Either way, is there any, uh, okay, I don't think we had anything else left in our inventory right there that we're kind of saving for the uh, community center, which is, oh, I guess if anything, we could do this, remember? Check if anything. Nope, I think we're, yep, I think we're good to go. All right, well, let's go over to Pierre. Let's go sell him the uh, the gold and the silver star parsnip, or uh, what do we have? Uh, green bean. I think we have a leak down there. I do not want to sell that. And uh, I don't think we have parsnip. I don't know why I said that. Gr regular green beans, we get 40 each. Nice, that's good money. 60 for a gold and 50 for the silver. Oh boy, let me get some of that. Let's see, uh, parsnip seeds, blah, blah, blah. So I assume he's not going to sell the new seeds until the start of the new uh, season. You know, it'd be really nice if he actually just sold it to me a little bit early. That way I already had it. Remember, we have good luck today, too. So, uh, oh, man, we got the field set. We got the candy bar there. Nice. All right, well, let's, let's check the calendar real quick. Yes, Emily's birthday. That's today. Oh, there's only, tw I don't know why I kept thinking there's 30 days. But no, yeah, tomorrow's the last day. Holy heck. We might actually get the start of summer here this episode, you guys. This is going to be crazy. Checking all the heck in trash can. <laughs> there's two more over here, though. Uh, whatever her name is that literally hate to hold on. Can I talk? Does she want to talk to me today? Just curious here. I'm feeling an urge to go shopping. Ugh, I wish there was a mall here. <laughs> well, at least she talked to me today, right? <laughs> and then just brush me off like a piece of trash in the wind. Oh, whoa, hold on. There's two people down there. Ah, man. I don't want to loot with them looking at me like this, but I guess I'll talk to Sebastian anyways. Randomly out in the... Wait, what in the world? One sec, I gotta beat this level. I didn't mean to... Is that? Yeah, that's Sebastian there in front, and then there's Sam right there. Oh wait, there you go. Now I can talk to him. What? I didn't hear you. I'm busy thinking about something. Okay, he's probably got his AirPods in. What do you want? <laughs> Jeez, everyone's so rude. One second, gotta beat this level. Okay, he must be playing something on his phone or something like that. I don't know. Either way. Oh yeah, and then I'm also I'm not paying attention to any of the wiggling that might be happening in the ground. To golly, everyone here seems a little happier on the weekends, don't you think? Yeah, I think so. I wonder why. I'm on the job seven days a week, though. Okay. Well, me too. Well, I used to be. Now I, now I only do videos six days a week, so at least I get a day off. I'm like Lewis over there working his butt cheeks off. What's it doing? Oh, if you're talking about butt cheeks, I completely forgot what I was doing. Oh, yeah, we need to go inside the saloon. Is she here? Uh, I think, does she, does she live here or where does she hang out? I guess she doesn't. I, I guess she's at home getting ready for work or something like that. Because I don't see her over here. Uh, Emily. So, uh, maybe I'll just wait until tonight to give her the uh, the gift. But for right now, I guess we'll go over to the blacksmith. Actually, yeah, before we do that, let, let's go down here. Let's go look and see if there's any, like, sea urchins or any other things that we can pick up over here. And let's keep talking to this guy, too. Keep getting a good relationship going with this guy. So we can actually go inside of his little hut over there. You probably wouldn't like it inside my cabin. It's dark and full of spiders. Oh, really? Well, I need to see that for myself. 
Nah, okay. Now, hold on, it said only his friends are on there. Like, what? When does someone become a friend, though, right? Like, three stars, five stars? Or does it actually need to be full? I assume it needs to be full. Because it'd be kind of weird to just be like... Well, I don't know. Like, that, like that'd actually take a long time. But then again, oh, wait, hey, look at that. We actually have a coral there. Finally, one had, like, washed up on this little reef area over here, or whatever this is. Interesting. But yeah, we didn't get a sea urchin or anything like that, but apparently we actually get good money out of this stuff, like coral and stuff like that. Hold on, do we need that? Nope, it's not pulsating or anything like that, so that's good. But yeah, I assume you do need it to be full. Uh, but you also, you also need it to be full to marry someone, right? So that's a little bit more than a friend. I don't know, maybe halfway is what you need to be, uh, for someone's friend. Maybe. Oh wait, what in the world? Where's the, uh... Wait, why is there a magnifying glass here? Well, it's a bin full of writhing, wiggling worms. It smells something awful. <laughs> I guess I didn't notice I was able to look in each one of these things here. Uh, more wiggling worms there. What about over here? There's a little pink shrimps moving around in there. Ew. What about this? I guess pink shrimps on the left and, uh, wiggling worms on the right, huh? I know, where's, uh, Willie at? Is he here? Or... A little sleepy cubby. And that's locked. That's like his back entrance there. Storage room or something like that. Who knows? Yeah, I don't know where Willie is. I just wanted to sell this this coral or whatever at right there just to get some good money out of it. Oh, wait. Oh, 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 oh. I see Wiggling. Speaking of Wiggling. Oh. Oh, I got clay. You see, apparently you're supposed to actually get more than just clay. But two times out of two that I've actually seen the Wiggling and mined it there, which is a lot easier to see it over here because it's the contrast of like the white, yellow, light yellow, like sand. Like, two out of two got clay out of that instead of whatever we're supposed to be getting, <laughs> which sucks. <sighs> All right, well, let me check over here real quick, just because we have more... It's easier to see in the... Or easier to see in the sand. I don't want to say it's easy in the sand and then completely miss another one. <laughs> but yeah, I'm not seeing it right there, which sucks. So I guess we'll go north. I guess we'll go check up on the uh, blacksmith or whatever. Uh, oh, it's 3.40 p.m. I don't know. Maybe, maybe by the time we're done with the blacksmith, Emily will actually be in the bar working. Oh, wait, hey, there's Willie right there, hey. But I don't think I'm able to sell me anything if it's not in the shop, right? If the local uh, fishing scene got a little bit more lively, I might expand the ship's or shop's stock. Couldn't speak at all right there. <laughs> and I need, yeah, I need to get more bait too for the uh, for the crab traps right there. So definitely want to do that. But for right now, let's go over here. Let's go check up on the blacksmith. See if our uh, copper pickaxe is done. And if so, hey, maybe next episode we we'll actually go. Uh, wait, 9 a.m. to 4 p.m. Oh wait, what? Ah oh, man, he closes early, but it's 420 right now. Let's go blazing over to the uh to the saloon and go see if oh, it was Emily. <laughs> see if Emily's over there. Haley, the Abigail, and uh a Pam. Oh jeez, she is angry with me. What? Make sure your boots are clean before you go stomping around in my house. I I don't even know where you live! It's annoying to clean a mess. You should know that by now. Uh does she know that I like it was like rainy and I like walked inside of her house or something like that? <laughs> The fresh mountain air is nice for a day like this. Uh, I wonder if the frogs will make an appearance soon. Well, I hope so, because they're they're just a big old meme, right? <laughs> Anyways, let's go over to the Star Drop Saloon. Oh, there she is. Fine, a heckin' way. Let's go give her a uh, leak, I guess. So, uh, you know, just give it to her for her birthday. Don't give it to Gus. Boom. Oh, a birthday gift. Thank you. All right. Well, I guess she liked it. So hopefully we have a, a heart with her now or what? Where is she? Where is, uh, oh yeah, look at that. Hey, we have a heart with Emily. Uh, we didn't even talk to her yet, so let's talk. I like making my own clothes, but it's not as easy as, or it's not easy to get cloth. Yeah, okay, interesting. So that makes sense. We just learned she was like, uh, something about like dyes or something like that. So it makes sense that she uh, is like a clothesmith or something. Is... Cut this out of the video. <laughs> clothesmith. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, it's such a long trip to the city. Okay, I don't know. Get it, get an Amazon Prime or something like that or something. <laughs> oh, hey, I'm back. Oh, wow, what a surprise. Pam is back at the bar? Whoa. Pam isn't responding. Yeah, I know. She's going straight back to her spot right there. Leah, I love to decorate for different seasons. Well, hey, you know, a new season... Oh, I was about to say almost a new season uh, starts tomorrow, but it starts the day after tomorrow. Hey, there's Shane. I'm surprised that you're still trying to make friends with me. <laughs> I haven't been rude enough to... What?! You gave me jalapeno poppers and stuff. What do you want? You want a field? Oh, wait. Oh, he's going how you went inside right there, man. I was trying to think of a gift to give him. Like, what in the world is his problem? <laughs> what is with Shane and Haley and 
Oh. Okay, I think I think it's safe. Oh, nothing there. Just trying to make use of our good luck today. Nothing there either. Right? Are there trash cans? I don't know if there are trash cans over here at these walls. There should be. That'd be kind of weird to have a house with no trash can. <laughs> now, can I go? I don't know if I can go through someone's house if there's heckin' cows watching. But there's no trash cans. There's actually no trash cans there. Right as I say that. There's no trash cans over here either, I don't think. Yeah. Now, that is actually strange. <laughs> okay. Hold on. Is there any wiggling going on? I saw some right there. It must have been just flowers and dancing or something like that, huh? Okay, well, at least we got, like, the main stuff we wanted to get. Oh, wait, one in the world, and Sebastian and, uh, that guy, Sam, randomly show up again. Hmm, I just remembered that I was meaning to do something, but I forgot. Oh, huh, me too. Happens to me all the time. I know, me too. <laughs> we should be best friends. You should be my new best friend instead of Shane, because he obviously hates me randomly. Penny, this is such a small town. You can't avoid, uh, meeting everyone. Yeah, I know. I'm like, that was literally the first mission. I wonder what it's like to live in the city. Huh. I wonder if we could ride the bus to the city, because you could ride, apparently ride the bus to the desert. I don't know if you could ride it to the city, though, or if the city even exists. Like, can you even go there? Oh, yeah, there is a, I forget there's a hospital there. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, the hospital's closed. They're closed at 3 p.m. They closed so early, jeez. Uh, oh, yeah, Pierre, I guess we'll see if we can sell this uh, random coral to Pierre, I suppose, huh? Uh, hey, he's still, oh, wait, uh, no, he's not here. Okay, well, whatever. Oh, and there's Abigail there, and then there's whatever her name is right there. Okay. So they say they hang out over here. Interesting. Uh, but I did get some comments from you guys uh, last episode saying that, like, the first thing I should buy is, like, chickens or something like that. So I'm like, it makes sense. I was like, we went over to whatever her name is specifically to talk to her about, like, uh, a chicken coop or something like that, right? I think that's, like, 10,000, isn't it? I forget. I need to go talk to her again. But, yeah, we're, we're at 1,200 right now, which is okay. Just that, you know, I'm kind of waiting for the new season so we can grow more stuff and get more money. So I guess, should we just kind of expedite that by going to sleep like right now? I'm kind of thinking it like, like I want to go inside of here, put the field. Oh, yeah, look at that. My dog's already asleep. I put the field snack up or something. I guess we'll put that here. I don't know. Clay, I guess. I'll put, where, where did I put the clay previously? Did I put that here? Nope. I guess I put it over here in the. Uh... Oh, yeah, I did. Yeah, look at this. Hey, boom. It snacks up noise. Wait, hold on. It's community set. Ooh, there's the community center icon there, so I could check from this without having to put it in my inventory first. Ooh. Interesting. Field snack there. Yeah, I guess I put the field snack over here just because it's like a regular item there. And then coral. Oh, wait, yeah. Oh, I do have a sea urchin. Yeah, look at that. Starting to pulsate there. Cool. Anything else? Oh, slime. Oh, yeah. I forgot. Yeah, we need like a lot of slime, don't we? Yeah. Oh, yeah, I forget. You can actually just check it from here, too. Yeah. So where do I need slime? It's probably not going to be like crops or anything like that, right? Artisan bundle? I don't know, maybe like a creep, like a, a, a monster drops bundle, uh, if that's a thing. Animal bundle. Oh, I was about to say, like, I, I guess a slime's an animal, but I guess not. <laughs> Winter foraging summer, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, these are not the right thing. And this is fish. Boiler. Was it the boiler room? Yes, it was the adventures bundle. OK, so we, yeah, we need 99 before we actually give it to that. Then bat wings and solar essence and whatnot. How many do we actually have right now, though? We have eight. <laughs> So we need 91 until we actually finish that. Okay. But I guess I'll grab the coral just because it seems like, uh, okay. I was about to say, like, can I donate that at the museum? But I guess, I guess it doesn't have a thing saying you can. So I, I I'll grab that and go sell it or something like that. Uh, then we have a broken CD right there for trash and soggy newspaper. I guess I'll keep that for right now. <laughs> then bug meat. We could use that for, uh, whatever else in the future, uh, making bait, but not right now. Probably when we actually have better fishing or something like that. Right. But tomorrow's the last day of the, uh, wrong, almost just sold the wrong thing right there, golly. And I guess we'll put, like, fertilizer, we'll put that in this chest, too, just so it's easy to, there you go. All right, nice. I guess we're good to go to go to bed at 8.40 p.m. like a boomer. <laughs> uh, hold on, what was it tomorrow? Is it, uh, really sunny or, uh, yeah, I think so. Yep, beautiful sunny all day tomorrow. All right, nice. Well, this video is already at, like, the 40-something minute mark, so I think I'm going to have to end it off right here, unfortunately. I was hoping, oh, jeez. Level 3 farming, bee house crafting recipe, craft a recipe for speed growth so I can make my own instead of just using the 10 or something like that that we got from uh, that, that spring crops bundle. And then a new cr uh, cooking recipe, farmer's lunch. I wonder what that is, probably like eggs and greens or something like that, potatoes, who knows, I guess we'll see. Either way, day 27 of spring, we got 160 from the sea urchin, or uh, not the sea urchin, the, uh, what is it called, coral. We have an urchin in our inventory. Uh, 80 from each one, not too bad I suppose, but... It's not really uh, any life-changing amounts of money. 
Hopefully we get life-changing amounts of money here whenever summer starts and we get new crops and we start growing them and getting a lot of money from that, right? But for right now, I guess we'll end off this video right here. We got a lot of progress done getting some good, like, like birthday gifts for both Pierre and, and Emily and also just generally just talking to people. And uh, is it even worth it to, I guess we'll I'll water my crops today anyways, just because, I don't know, are they just going to like die on the first day of summer or like what? I don't know. But I guess I'll just water these crops anyways, just as a force of habit, right, huh? Uh, and then I guess, real quick, even though I am ending the episode, I, I guess I'll go check him on the blacksmith. Just because I wanted to go do it yesterday and I wasn't able to do... Because I, went, I literally showed up at his house at like, what? 4.10 and he closes at 4, so... Like, literally, just like, just like whenever we went to, uh... What was his name? Robin? Was that his name? No, Lewis. Went to Lewis to go do his mission to, uh, you know, was it kill eight slimes or something like that? To go claim that reward on the last day of the mission was available. And I went there at like 10, oh, or like 10, 10. He closes at 10. So we're literally like as late or as I watered them. <laughs> I can bulletin board over here. I was, I was just barely late right there, which sucks. Either way, that was the wrong thing. I wanted to see, Let's see. And stop watering the bulletin. <laughs> I need wild horseradish to rub on my sore tooth. Bring me one ASAP, Emily. 150 on uh, delivery. Well, I I think I have horseradish at home. I need to go check, but I do have a leak. Uh, either way, I guess we'll check up on the blacksmith. I don't know why I'm doing this stuff because I'm like, it's just going to. Whenever I record next episode, it's just going to start us at 6 a.m. or whatever on this day. So I have to redo all this stuff next episode. But just for curiosity, yeah, I'm not, I don't know if there are any wiggle. Is there any black wiggling creatures in the ground? Every every now and then I'm just like, oh, did, did I miss anything? Because there's literally someone in the comments that said they're going to make a compilation video of every time I missed. Oh, and it opens at nine. Okay, I, I I'm either too late or I'm too early with this guy. Golly. <laughs> All right, well I, I might as well use this opportunity. Oh gosh, we got green algae right there. Nice. Uh, I don't even know what was today's luck. I checked the weather. I think right. I don't think I checked. Oh, I got broken glasses again. Nice. Uh, I don't know what I'm saying right there. Oh yeah, I was looking around for the. Little black, wiggly, wormy guys there. And it's almost 9 a.m. right now, which is nice. I guess I'm just <laughs> literally just passing the time by checking through all the heckin' trash cans over here. <laughs> all right, let's go inside. Let's check him on the blacksmith. See if our pickaxe is done. Is he done or uh? Oh, we got the pick. Hey, we got the copper pickaxe. You received the copper pickaxe. All right. Well, I guess we'll have to do that again tomorrow. I don't know why I did it right now, but uh, curiosity, right? Uh, killed the cat. So let's not do that or else some cats are going to get murdered and I don't want to get demonetized. So either way, I guess I will just end off the video right here and I'll have to redo all this stuff next episode. So <laughs> thank you guys all very much for watching. If you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to let me know by leaving a like down below. And if you guys want more of these awesome videos, be sure to hit that subscribe button. And while you're down there, be sure to ring that bell so YouTube sends you a notification as soon as next episode of Stardew Valley comes out. Because next episode, it's going to be the first, well, well you want to start out on the last day of spring but it's going to be the first day of summer tomorrow i'm very excited to see how things change once we actually like jump into a new season like are all my crops going to die immediately and i'll be able to buy all new like crop seeds from pierre and we'll have a bunch of hacking crops growing over there we'll maybe we'll oh yeah we're actually able to go buy the uh iron ore from uh clint the blacksmith now and now we're actually able to make the sprinkler so there's, there's a lot of cool stuff i want to do next episode you guys but until then thank you guys all very much for watching and I'll see you guys here next time with some more Stardew Valley. Oh, bye there. <laughs>